Disclaimer, this tutorial is meant for those who have a notable understanding on the topic of computers. If you generally don't feel the use of this, then do not attempt this. All websites shown in the video were all safe and were tested before the making of this video. All actions are your responsibility and will not take any responsibility of banned accounts. So to get started to install Better Discord, what we are going to be needing to do is obviously going to the description and finding the Discord link. So as you can see, um, the Discord itself, it has literally no modifications. It's just plain old Discord. Now we want to customize the theme. So to do this, we um, go to the Discord links in the Discord um, server that you can join in the link. In the description uh, all we have to do is we go to this github page which is linked in the discord uh, download bandaged BD now once we have this we can just drag this into our desktop we can minimize out and then we can double click it click on run so firstly you want to press agree and then you want to install bandaged BD bandaged um so you guys will get three options install to stable install to canary install to ptb now what we want to do is we want to install to stable because i have a stable version of discord if you have a different version of discord for example canary or ptb you can install those then just go and left click on install and your discord should once again open Um, we can go to user settings and then we, as you can see we should get a new window called bandaged BD. So once we've got this window what we can do is we can just go down, um, go to themes for a moment and you guys should get another link in the discord server for better discord library for themes. So we can go ahead and get one of the themes. Um, say for example if I wanted the Midnight UI, okay just download this, now it's going to give me a CSS file, we can just open th the theme folder, we can go back and we can just drag and drop this CSS file into the folder. Once we've done that, it should say the midnight UI was loaded. We, um, now we can toggle this on and it's finally been applied. And as you can see, whoa, this looks different. Okay, so we have a totally new Discord. I don't even know how to navigate. Okay, so we can go to plugins and then install some plugins. Um, for example, this one, you can just get it. And once again, we did the same trick. Go down to the plugins folder. And then just paste it into there. And it should say it has been loaded, so download now. Oh, uh, once it has downloaded, what we can do is we can toggle M on. And there we go. So we have a totally new Discord. Uh, I'll leave the links to the Midnight UI in the description if you really want it. And that's about it.